Hi students, this is Alex here. In this video, we have to prove the radius of curvature is a into theta for the given equation. So the equation is in the form of the parametric. As a first part, we have to find dx by d theta. So here we take a which is constant. Cos theta differentiation is minus sin theta plus here we have product of two term so we have to follow product rule the product rule is uv method which is u dash v plus u v dash so the first element is u so theta differentiation is 1 and v we have to write as it is plus u we have to write as it is and v dash sin theta differentiation is cos theta. Finally, minus sin theta plus sin theta we can cancel. We get a theta cos theta. Now, dy by d theta is a into bracket open. Sin theta differentiation is cos theta. Then we have product of two term. Take minus open a bracket. So, u differentiation is 1 into cos theta as it is which is v plus u is written as it is and differentiation of cos theta is minus sin theta. Now we have to take this minus inside. So a into cos theta minus cos theta when I multiply this minus with this it will become plus plus theta sin theta. So after cancelling this, we get a theta sin theta. So from these two, we can find dy by dx. dy by dx is a theta sin theta whole division a theta cos theta. We can cancel a theta sin theta by cos theta is tan theta. Now, we have to find its second derivative d square y by dx square tan theta is secant square theta into theta differentiation is d theta by dx as per the chain rule because we do differentiation with respect to x and d theta by dx we can take from here this is dx by d theta so d theta by dx will be reciprocal of this 1 by a theta cos theta so this value will be 1 by a theta cos theta secant square theta into 1 by a theta cos theta. Now we can bring this down as 1 by cos square theta along with that we have a theta cos theta. So finally the second derivative is 1 by a theta cos cube theta. Now the radius of curvature rho is 1 plus dy by dx whole square whole power 3 by 2 whole division d square y by dx square. So this will be 1 plus dy by dx is tan theta. Here it is dy by dx whole square. So tan square theta whole power 3 by 2 whole division 1 by a theta cos cube theta. The numerator we have 1 plus tan square theta which is the trigonometric identity. The formula is secant square theta. So we get secant square theta for that power 3 by 2 whole division 1 into this term we can multiply with the numerator as a theta cos cube theta here we can cancel these two so we left with secant cube theta and secant cube theta we can carry to the denominator as cos cube theta and in the numerator we have a theta cos cube theta after cancelling we get the radius of 
curvature rho is a into theta. So, we got the proof.